Okay, we are going to be running a lab test, brazing a brass shaft to a brass hub. We're going to be using our model HFI 5 kilowatt power supply. We're using a braze ring for our medium and the trick of this application is that we need the braze alloy to flow all the way through uh, to the, the bottom of the hub. In order to do that, we're going to be using a step program on the power supply that allows us to start running the hub at, or the component at high power, and then at a certain time level, it will drop to a much lower power to allow the heat to dwell and migrate to the bottom of the of the hub and allow that braze alloy to pull down. Power is on now. We're initially running this system at 95% power. It's going to run for 45 seconds. You can see that the part is now starting to turn color. We're closing in on 45 seconds. And now the power has dropped down to 43, 44% power and will dwell for another 25 seconds. Now you can see the red color migrating to the bottom of the part without burning the top. And the part is done. See the braze alloy is starting to solidify. And after the part is cooled, we'll show you that the braze alloy has migrated. You can see the bottom of the part, there's a silverish color around the hub and the shaft, which is the braze alloy that has migrated through. Okay, we're running a second part to show, with the same program, to show repeatability. And power is on now. We're at 35 seconds in and the part is starting to change color. We've just dropped our power down to 44%, allowing the part to dwell. Brace cycle is complete. Okay, this is the second portion of the brace cycle. This is the upper part. And we're going to be using the same brazing recipe as previously used on the 
bottom portion of the shaft. Power is on now. Now approaching 45 seconds and the power is dropping off right now. Again, allowing the part to dwell without burning or melting the brass. And the part is complete. You can see a nice brace fillet on the back side of the hub. along with the, the top. We will repeat the process one more time again just to show consistency. Power is on now. Part is turning red. Power has dropped from 95% down to 44%. And the cycle is complete. This concludes our tests.